Hey there guys, in this video one of my best core exercises for overall core strength and that is the Paloff Press. So I shall see you after the logos. Hey guys, Jason Nepali here from the trainersedge.co.uk and today I want to summarise one of my top recommended exercises to help you develop a better overall core strength and stability and this exercise is known as the Paloff Press. So if you have a look at the typical exercises that most people use in their core strength routine in the gym, you're most likely going to see the same old overused used, um, exercises like crunches and leg raises and sit-ups being performed over and over again. Okay, so there's certainly nothing wrong with including these particular movements into your overall training plan, but it's vital for you to realise that your core is actually extends way beyond just the surface of the six-pack muscles that most people mainly concern with developing. So having a strong and well-developed core is going to greatly improve your total body strength, functionality and reduce the chances of injury, whilst a weak and undeveloped core is going to do the opposite. So your core is actually a highly complex set of muscles that include basically everything except your arms and legs. And it is involved in practically every functional movement pattern that your body performs throughout the day and for any exercise. So the main benefit of the Paloff Press is like any other typical crunch or leg raise type of movement. This particular exercise trains your core based on its primary function which is to act as a stabiliser and a force transfer from the upper to lower body and vice versa, rather than as a prime mover. Most people primarily train their core as a prime mover in isolation, so they miss out the opportunity and potential of benefits as a result. Okay, so there's several different Paloff Press variations that you could perform, but I'm simply going to outline here for you the basic form that I recommend for most people to start off with. So I'm going to overlay a video demonstration here of a Paloff Press. So, okay, so what you're going to do is grab a band or a cable with a single hand and then take a few steps directly out to your side and then you're going to stand with your feet shoulder width apart in a good athletic stance with your knees slightly bent keeping your chest high and your shoulders back and under a complete control without letting your torso sway or move back and forth you're going to fully extend your arms out in front of you and hold for a count of maybe 10 seconds and then return to the starting position. For a greater core stabilisation, I sometimes ask the client to bring the cable or band into the chest and out and press out for in and out for a count of 10 and then hold out in front for another count of 10. I recommend to performing this exercise for about 2-3 to three sets of eight, between 8 and 12 reps. So 2-3 to three sets facing one way, 2-3 to three sets facing the other way and alter, alternating back and forth. Keep in mind that here that the narrower the stance you have, the harder the exercise becomes. So you're going to want to keep your feet at about shoulder width apart at all times and select a weight that allows you to perform 10 reps under control. Don't think of this as an explosive power of movement. I recommend including this exercise in your routine one or two times a week along with the other core strength exercises that I will be outlining in future videos. So if you found this video helpful, please leave a comment and a thumbs up below. Uh, please hit the like button and share with your friends and let me know if you want me to cover any topic in future videos. So hey I'm Coach Jason, thank you for watching, have an awesome day and I'll see you on another video.